People I spoke with say it was extremely hard to watch. One minute, the man was working on the tree. The next, he was hanging, pleading for his life. You got me mad, because I, because it's someone's loved one. Like, he didn't think he was gonna, that was gonna happen today. Emergency crews responding to the 300 block of North 15th Street in Immokalee. Somebody was screaming for help, and then um, they said that uh, he was moving his hand, that he was calling someone to for help. 36-year-old Esteban Antonio was working on a tree when the accident happened. I got scared. Everybody, everybody was scared because we didn't know if he was um, alive. Witnesses say the chainsaw Antonio was using cut him on his side while he was up in the tree. He was left there hanging, but due to how high up he was, witnesses were unable to do anything. You know how you do, you're, like, you're in pain and you go like, ugh, he was doing something like that, and then we just saw like some clear liquid come out of, his, out of his mouth or his nose. I don't know what it was. Fire crews attempted to bring Antonio down after being stuck in the tree for almost two hours. That's when they went up there and they're trying to get him down, and then whenever they brought him down, he was already, he was already gone. I felt so bad for him. I knew he was going in so much pain, and I know, I know he wanted someone to help him, but no one did. And Collier County deputies are saying this death is not suspicious. We will continue to monitor this uh, situation further. The minute we learn more, we'll be sure to bring that to you on our free NBC2 News app. We're live in Immokalee tonight. Joseph Ojo, NBC2.